The 2024 Morgan and Peace program is just down the pike, not too far away. And that gives us an opportunity to go back and look again one more time at 2023 and make sure we have what we need to continue this program. Tonight, the 23 Peace. Look at this deal. So tonight, we're going back and following the exact format that we're going to be seeing over the next three or four months, which is 2024 style. And that is the very first coin out last year. Middle of the year, just like right now, is the uncirculated. They made 275,000 coins. You're looking at it right there. High relief, pure silver, sold out instantly. With the 2024s right around the pike, our competition right now raised their prices from 149, 159 up to 179 for that coin by itself. We're with a small quantity still in inventory. Look at our price. We're at 89.95. That special. And then coin two is the other peace dollar they sold individually last year, and that is the first ever proof peace dollar. Period. The old vintage Morgans, Philadelphia Mint, made a few over the years, but when the Peace Dollar series was introduced in 1921 and it ran through 1935, there were no proof vintage Peace Dollars. So in the Peace Dollar family, this is the very first one ever to be struck. And it happens to be a San Francisco, which makes it even a little bit more special. San Francisco makes all of our special issues for the most part right now. And you can really see the difference. On this one, just like the uncirculated I referenced earlier, my competition was give or take $150 a coin, and they raised their prices to $179, $189. Well, tonight, look at our price, $99.95 on the proof. Now, the original government packaging is part of this process. It is the coins in the capsules. There's a special gift box that the coins go in, then there's a wrap over the box, which you saw on the right, and then the certificate of authenticity from the U.S. Mint on the left. Now again, July 11th is that strike date, and we're thrilled to have a few of the 2023s here to work from. The mintage figures again were 275,000 of the peace dollar, uncirculated, the one you're looking at, that sold out, and then the proof version was 400,000. Now on the proof, just as a reference, it's gonna be a scramble in 2024 because the, the US Mint is lowering the mintage figure. So as a result, the, everybody that got it last year will not have the opportunity to get it this year. But when it comes down to it, I look at it as, well, what else was out there in 2023? We had the proof Silver Eagle, which is the other big coin of the year, right? We had, give or take, 500,000 coins made. We had the San Francisco proof that was launched a little bit later in the year, 2023. Give or take 200,000 is where that one kind of sits every year, and it has been since 2018 when they started striking both of them. Have you seen either of those with mintages higher than these for even close to these prices? Now, a couple of other little tidbits on the peace dollar. So the excitement of this program and the continuation from the U.S. Mint of this program is that in 2021, a couple of years ago, we celebrated the 100th anniversary of the very first ever peace dollar. And that was made in high relief. It was made in December only. And then full production started in 1922. The high relief wasn't effective in circulation. It was just too high. When the main item on the coin, in this case the eagle on the reverse, Lady Liberty on the obverse, is higher than the rim, they're not a functional coin for circulation. You can't stack them, right? So they flattened it out and put it into full production in 1922, Philadelphia, Denver, San Francisco. But the original, 1921, was made in high relief. It was meant to be an artistic statement on the modernization of our silver dollar. The Morgan dollar that was part of our vernacular from 1878 to 1904, and then again for one more year in 1921 while they were working on the peace dollar design, right, 
we wanted to have it look like the Walking Liberty, Standing Liberty Quarter, Mercury Dime, which have all been redesigned just only a matter of a few years earlier. Now these coins, you're looking at the 2023s, they are also in high relief. You can tell by this, looking at the detail, outstanding. But the other thing that's a little bit different on the brand new ones is they're made in pure silver, which is 0.999 fine versus the original piece dollars at 0.900. Reason why is these are intended for collectors. The U.S. Mint knows it. That's why they can make it in high relief and they can make it in pure silver where it wouldn't be functional as a coin in circulation. So join us, everybody, but not at the 150, the 179 price points we're seeing out there for the same exact coins from last year. If you have one, get another one. All I know is the 2024s are, are hot. There's a lot of people pre-selling them already. And that's okay as well. But we're concentrating on the coins that are physically here right now. And those are the 23s. At least a few of them. And then they'll pass. Guys, we got to put a one minute clock up on this one. Thank you all for interacting. Yes, there was a reverse proof. Thank you for bringing that up. It was only sold in the two piece set. So tonight we're concentrating on the original government packaging of the peace dollars, the high relief peace dollars, and these are the only two the government made last year as solo or individual coins. And yes, they will be making a 2024 reverse proof as well, also as a set. They're following that pattern. OGP, original government packaging, what you're seeing on your screen in the wider shot is what you will be getting. But tonight, you're only paying our prices, $89.95, $99.95. Uh, do we have 2021 peace dollars? Yes, we do. Check out our website, avccoins.com, or ask our operators. They can go through the system and find it. I know we have a few in stock. I was looking at them this morning. Happy to work with you on them. But don't miss out, everybody. This is, this is where you want to be, especially the prices. With my competition at $80, $90 more per coin. For the same coins, it's time to buy.